quick video real quick to show you um, how I'm curing the inside of these prints. So my son's helping me with the camera work. So, so hard. It's okay. <laughs> so I went on, don't worry about the statue right now. I went on uh, Amazon and I bought a bunch of LEDs. Oh. These are, oh look at the light, look at the LEDs. I bought some five millimeter LEDs and I bought some three millimeter, three millimeter, yeah, three millimeter LEDs. And these already have resistors on them. I just soldered them up so I could plug them into some nine volt batteries. The three millimeters are a little fancier. I put more lights per battery and it's got a switch. These are just, have the little, these little things. So um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna stick these in here. I got the five millimeters for bigger prints so I can get them in, in the bigger holes. And if you can see, when I slide these in here, you see that Owen, his head's lighting up Owen? Yeah. You can see that his head's lighting up on the inside. And I can take these lights and I can move them around and get them to all the little nooks and crannies to make sure I get UV light uh, where I need it to cure the print. And I'm only doing this for about, I don't know, 30 seconds or so. And these lights are strong enough to cure the resin. I'll show you here in a second. I'll show you a little test. I'm having a hard time doing this because I'm trying to make sure, as long as Owen can uh, make sure it's in video, in, in frame. I do this. So like I'm trying to get the lights down in his head. And there we go. Okay. So I can get there and I can I can move the lights around his head, make sure I get all the nooks and crannies. And I can move them up. And I can move them around, get all the shoulders and stuff. So I got two going on here. I made a bunch of these, probably more. I made like 30 of these little battery things, but my uh, thought was I can have a bunch of these sitting around and carrying a bunch of prints at one time. So I can put, like on the little prints, I can put three, four little three millimeter LEDs into all my drain holes and just kind of stick them inside the print and let them sit there for a minute or so. So I've been doing this to cure the inside of these, all these prints. I've got a shitload of prints to cure. Um, so I'm just doing this, you know, about 30 seconds to a minute. And uh, before I did this, I tested it. So, right, I'll come over here. So what I did is I took, um, I got a little, I'm gonna, we're gonna record the spatula. So what I did is I took, um, I just took a little resin, I got a print going out on the spatula. And I simply just took the LED and I just pointed it at the spatula. And give it a second, and this is gonna cure up. See so how it's going to drip? And the drip stopped, so it cured. And that took, about, I don't know, a couple seconds. So like, give me here at about five, 10 seconds and this will peel off. So the wavelength of these lights is actually, I think uh, 395 nanometers. You know, the ideal wavelength is 405, but these are just strong enough to, to cure this resin. Now if I go to my spatula here, you can see that it peels off. So it cured. So that's what I'm doing to cure the inside of these prints. So just a quick little video. Thank, thank you to my awesome cameraman for helping me out. But yeah, so I just went, like I said, I went to Amazon, I bought a bunch of these, uh, these are five millimeter. I bought a bunch of three millimeter, uh, wired them up, simple nine volt battery. Um, so yeah, I, I got that for a tip from another YouTuber and I can't remember his name off the top of my head. Uh, my buddy Omar recommended a dental UV light for curing, but unfortunately that little light doesn't get into the little tiny prints. So, but it, it would get into this big print. Uh, but for the little stuff, uh, I decided to go with LEDs and they uh, seem to be working pretty good. Um, like I can even get into the katanas here and the smaller lights, but that's what I'm doing to cure, cure the inside of these prints. You know, about, it doesn't take long. Um, like I said, I'm using about 30 seconds to a minute. On the little prints about a minute on this big guy i'll probably spend a good amount of time just making sure i get the light in all the different areas of it so it's cured because i don't want this thing cracking later but uh there you go quick little video on how i'm curing the inside of the prints